The Runaway Pancake. There once was a woman who decided to make some delicious pancakes for her seven children. She beat the eggs, mixed in some sugar and flour, and added some milk to make the batter. She then poured the batter into the frying pan. A delicious smell began to fill the house. The children took a whiff and were immediately hungry. I want some pancakes now. I'm hungry, Mother. Can I have a taste? Just a little. It'll be done soon enough. Let me just flip it over. But just as the woman was about to toss the pancake in the air, the pancake jumped, did a quick flip, and landed on the floor. You're all going to try to eat me! Catch me if you can! The pancake rolled and rolled and rolled until it was out the door. The woman and her seven children chased the pancake in a hurry. Come back! Even the children's grandmother joined the chase. Somebody stop that pancake! But the pancake just kept rolling and rolling and rolling along. Soon, the pancake came across a rooster. What a delicious looking pancake! Where are you going in such a hurry? Stay a while so I can eat you. I just ran away from those seven children. I'm not going to get eaten by a rooster. The pancake just kept rolling and rolling and rolling along. Next, the pancake came across a goose. What a delicious looking pancake. Where are you going in such a hurry? Stay a while so I can eat you. I just ran away from those seven children. I'm not going to get eaten by a goose. The pancake just kept rolling and rolling and rolling along. Next, the pancake came across a pig. Hello there, Mr. Pancake. I just ran away from those seven children. I'm not going to get eaten by a pig. The pancake just kept rolling and rolling and rolling along. But the pig didn't try to eat the pancake. You don't have to run, Mr. Pancake. I'd just like to take a pleasant walk with you. Oh, I see. That does sound pleasant. The pancake decided to take a walk with the pig. After a while, the pig and the pancake arrived at a river. There didn't seem to be any bridges nearby. Oh dear, I can't swim. If I go in the water, I'll turn all soggy. Then why don't you ride on top of my snout? I'll swim you to the other side. Thank you, Mr. Pig! The pancake rolled on top of the pig's snout. The pleasure's all mine, Mr. Pancake! And with that, the pig opened its mouth wide and went chomp, chomp, chomp as it ate up the pancake. The pig continued to enjoy the pancake, looking quite content. The end.